He tells her she can pay the ticket or fight the ticket, which sounds legally correct to me. And he asks her to sign the ticket, but she objects. Now, it's true. You never have to sign anything someone puts to you, including a police officer. I mean, you just don't have to. But here's why the cop asked her or really told her to sign it. Because it's her promise to either pay the ticket or fight the ticket in court, as opposed to just driving away and never coming back. Because if you recall, she said she was from South Carolina, and this was in the Commonwealth of Virginia. Here, he explains it. Hold on. Mm -hmm. All right, so what you're signing here is a promise to either come to court or a promise to prepay. It's not an admission of guilt. It's only a promise to me that you're going to get it taken care of by either coming to court or prepaying it. If you refuse to sign the summons at this point, I'm going to have to get you out of the police car, out of this car. I'm going to place you under arrest and take you in front of a magistrate. I will get your vehicle towed and go from there. So, yes, ma'am, you do not have a choice. You have. I don't care about that. You do not have. I don't care who's on the phone. I'm talking to you right now. You do not have a choice but to sign the summons. So once again, you're signing right there. So thank you. I knew you were going to sign it. Thank you very much. All right. Appreciate it very much. And you have a very safe day. Okay. Thank you. And we're done. Now, that last part wasn't too friendly, was it? But he explained his point. If she didn't promise to either pay the ticket or promise to come back to court to fight the ticket, those are basically your two options, he would have to arrest her and bring her to the magistrate, the judge, right then and there. And it wasn't friendly anymore, but it wasn't particularly rude. And there was no sexism or racism, was there? That's an excerpt from my daily TV show, The Ezra Levant Show. Normally it's behind a paywall, but I thought you'd like this video, so we put it on YouTube. Uh, if you want to subscribe to watch The Daily Show every day, including always two interviews a day and I read my hate mail, just click on this screen and become a premium member.